bien, bien. Um, good evening. I have another cold, which is brilliant. Um, it's kind of come on over the last uh, couple of days. I've took lem sip. Um, I have got my snot rag. Brilliant. Uh, well, we'll get these on here. I'm having flushes and everything, but I'm here. But I'm um, yeah, there was no way could I, I cancel uh, and call and, 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 and do a city tonight uh, simply because I thought, well, this is the last night of your uh, Black Friday code. And I thought, well, I've got to be there. I've got to be there. So um, I'm here. Yay. So who have we got in? Let's have a look because I'm going to do something a, a little bit different. I'm going to demonstrate a product over there in a minute, which will, will be funny. Uh, evening you, Sam Paul. He said, Christine, yes, I've got a cold. I've got a cold, but this one's quite a heavy cold. Um, but I'm fine. I will get through it with, with your your friendship. Hola, como estas? Bien. Oh, we'll turn her down. We'll turn her down. She gets right on my nerves. Hi, Brenda. I hope you're well, my darling. Uh, Joel Williams is in, great. Gary Simpson's in, Jane Marie Galley's in there. Evening, Lisa Hall, hope you get better soon. Oh, I will, I will, I've got my snack run. I've actually had, oh, if I could, I've actually had a lem sip. Oh, you bugger. So I feel a bit better. So I've got a beer, I'm good. I don't know what I've any. I don't know if that's gonna go down well, but I'll probably end up going on the water, but never mind. Uh, Leo's in, hi, Leo. Oh. Oh, loads of snot came out there. Oh, nice. <laughs> uh, Teresa Ellis is watching as well. Hi, Teresa. Oh, that was proper snotty. You know, you know when your nose gets so sore because you've been rubbing it too much? That's where I'm at, guys. That's where I'm at. Uh, Karen said, I'm here. Thank goodness. Karen, where would I be without you? Where would I be without you? Um, so, what I've decided to do is, obviously, uh, as you know, uh, there's 20% off everything up until 11.59 tonight. Could you be any more precise? Because, um, obviously, that is the end of the, the Black Friday. Um, so, make sure any gifts that you say you, you nab tonight, right? Anything that you say nab. Don't wait for us to come off air. Go and get it. And you know where to go. www.shopwithlisab.com dab uh, i've added the dab bit now um <laughs> celia's watching devon stanley is watching as well hi devon hope you're well my lovelies uh so uh i'm gonna click on two of this now as you know 20 percent of everything also we slashed slashed uh the toys didn't we so what i'm gonna do is now this could go terribly wrong <laughs> uh hi t hi lisa full of cold bless you hot toddies needed yeah I'm a great, if I could drink it, I would, but I kind of drink whiskey and all that malarkey. So I'm having a beer and I'm seeing if that'll make us feel better with, with some lem sip. Uh, Karen Hughes is saying hi to Karen Hughes. Brilliant, we've got two Karen Hughes. Uh, so, if I, what I'm going to do is, uh, I'm going to tempt, <laughs> this, this should be, put the pop-up tent up, right, to show you how easy it is, she says. Let, what can go wrong? I hear you scream. <laughs> a bloody lot. Um, so we'll find it first. There's a lot of stuff being sold out, by the way. Um, so anything that you say, like I say, the, the, the creams have now gone. The moisturiser, but I am going to get them in again. Hi, Anthony, darling. I hope you're well. There it is there. So your creams have gone. We've still got your face mask, and obviously we've still got your uh, Asai. Uh, polo neck's gone, the red jumper's gone. Oh, you are loving them. I'm not surprised. Right, so, like I say, this is either going to go brilliantly right or terribly wrong. <laughs> Let's hope it's the first one, eh? So, I'm going to have to get the camera right. So, we'll click onto that. Right, so that should come on now. So, it is your Pink Princess pop-up tent. Now, it's, it was originally $26.95. JJ then slashed it down to $12.95. But then you've got 20% off. I know. Uh, so then you've got 20% off. So you're getting this for just over a tenner. Wait until you see. Even Karen, darling, you're I should be taking my vitamins, shouldn't I? Let's see what this vitamin's like. What vitamin are you getting in here? Vitamin yeast. <laughs> That's the only thing I could think of. Uh, Mark Reg Coxon is watching. Dawn Spencer is watching. Emma said, hi Lisa, how are you? I'm a bit snotty. I'm a bit snotty, Emma. 
and but the show must go on so if i take this over here where's my puff i'll have a puff of my puff up. that's important uh, and then i'm going to turn right somewhere there. right what i'm going to do is i'm going to turn the camera around like like, like i said it's either going to go terribly right oh, or terribly wrong Da -da. so let me just quickly turn this camera around bear with me guys so now you'll probably see lights and you're going to see all my living room and stuff like that but there is a reason i promise sorry if you got a bit sick there now can we see that there yay what i'll do is we'll just flip that light there so you're not getting that reflection there is that a bit better yes i think that's fine so Welcome to my humble abode. Uh, right, you've got your snot rag here. I've got my puffer here. Uh, Percy said vitamin B, is that what I need? Uh, Mark Red, Red Cox said, hi Lisa, enjoy your drink. Well, I'm hoping it's going to make us feel a bit better. So, why have I moved just here? I hear you ask, right? There is a reason. There is a reason. So, Jane Osborne's watching. Hi, Jane, darling. So this is, now this is the princess pop-up tent. We do have a boys' rocket tent, and it kind of works in exactly the same format, if you like. And what I'm going to do is, it might be better if I just quickly turn that light around so you can see me a little bit better. Hopefully you can see us now a little bit better. So, uh, B for beer. Nice. Uh, <coughs> Jane Osborne's watch, I don't said hello to you, Jane, but I'll say hello to you again. So, uh, as you can see, you've got now this, you're probably thinking, hang on a second, I don't want a tent in the house because it's going to take up too much room. No. This is your tent. So, I'll take them out because they're just your little pegs, right? So, that's your tent. So, if you're worried about kind of room and where you're going to put quite a large tent, don't. If you've got any little girls that you've got to buy for this Christmas, this is the thing to buy them. And the mums and dads will be happy because you can just put that away dead easy. So, uh, Chris Lewin is watching. Hi, Chris. Jane Osborne says, hi, Lisa B. Uh, oh, Vicky's watching. It's her birthday tomorrow. Oh, I know. So, yeah, pink prints, prints. So, that's it. But then, gone are the Wendy House days. So, you think about, well, I'm going to second this, how that, how is that going to hold up? Well, this is where this comes into play to make it now i used to work for saint and we used to have to do the tenon the tenon tents and it was on the same principle but you didn't have these bits and after a while the tenon tents and anybody who's a tanner will be nodding right now will tell you that after a while the tents tend to misshape they fall over um so this is just an extra bit of support to give that point and to make sure that when the kids are running it out of it it doesn't start getting all misshaped um so we got uh, Joanne Edwards is in watching. Hi, Joanne, darling. So how do these go up? Right. So I'm going to show you. It's dead easy. It's a simple. It's like a magician stick. What? Well, you can even, I even turn around and go. I like this idea. Hang on. Pretend it's a wand. And go. Abracadabra. I'm going to make my wand big. I bet you a lot of men wish they could say that. <laughs> no, it kind of didn't work, did it? No, it kind of didn't work, that one. <laughs> so, you literally, now this is how quick you can pop this tent up for the kids. So if we just get that in there, hang on, bear with it. I said this was going to go horribly wrong, didn't I? I have been practising as well, bless us. So if I just climb in a second, talk amongst yourselves, people. So, I literally just pop that in there, pop that in there. And then, oh, that fit. But sorry about me fat bomb, people. That bit goes in there. And then it clips onto there. So then, oh, I'm going to clip. So that's one of the main. Then, hi. Uh, who else we got in? Uh, we got John John Oliver watches. Uh, Kirsty said, not saying a word, honey. I know, I hear you, I hear you. That one's a good bend. And then, so, we'll go into the next one. Now, remember Wendy houses? They took you all day to put up. 
There was a thousand different bits, wasn't there? No, it's not like that, this. So we'll pop that in. This bit, we'll put it into uh, 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 into that bit. See? Who needs to be an engineer? Eh? Gone all them days. And I just put that into there. So that's another bit of it done. Then we've got two more, I think, bits to do like that. So now you try to see how it's starting to take shape. Then clip that one into here. I'm looking for the hole, people. I'm looking for the hole. <laughs> oh, yes. You know what I'm going to say next story of my life. So that one clips into there, and that clips to there. And then we've got one more. One more to put in. And then that's the tent up. So it's simple, it's dead easy. It literally kind of just does it itself. You're just slotting them in to the little bits. So if I just nip into this, put that right into there, and then that bit goes into there. Who needs a bloody man, eh? Who needs a man? Ta da And then that, my friends, is your princess tent. Now you can see you've got windows either side of this, you can roll them up uh, or you can have them down the door itself. You literally, you literally just roll up, roll up, roll up, a little toggle and a little toggle there and it's the same with the windows, you can roll the windows up. What I suggested, which I thought was a really good suggestion, was... What you could do is all the kiddies' toys. So there you go, you've got your door there, and then the kids, and it's, it's a really big one as well, look. Oh, there's a scene, I like the scene. And look, even I can get in it. Hi! That, you could probably get me in this twice over. So I'm thinking you could probably get the little girls in it. You could probably get, you know, three or four little girls in there, easy. But what you could do, Christmas mode, so you can see it's kind of the princess tent castle. Um, what you could do with all that Christmas gifts, wrap them all up, right, pile them all in there, and then Christmas morning, put the doors down and the windows down, like so. Just clip that to there, and clip that one to there. I've all got that little stock of bits there, you can see. Um, and then all the toys are in there, then when the little girls go uh, to play, to open up, Boom! All the full of toys. Excellent. I love that idea. And obviously the little boy's tent uh, is a rocket and it works on the same principle. So that there, that there, it says, uh, you've gone all big TV now. I know, I know. Uh, good evening, young lady, lady says Pete Collins. Um, are you selling your sofa? <laughs> oh, don't you start. Don't you start. Not like the last time. Uh, who else we've got in here? Mark uh, Warby Warburton's there. Uh, what am I videoing on? I'm videoing on a, my Mevo camera. Chris Bull's watching. Elias uh, said it's his birthday on Sunday. Are you doing anything on live? Lisa, oh, we'll have to sort something out for you. Uh, Kirsty said small, medium or large. Um, Mark Reg Coxon said this is amazing. Great, yeah. Uh, Kerry Hawley was watching. Uh, Karen said it suits you, honey. Pink. Keith Moore Jew's there. Um, because he said that looks brilliant from this end. Celia said, very funny you are, Lisa. Paul's in, hiya. Uh, so yeah, so basically that there is, it, it's dead lightweight as well as you can see there, look. Uh, that there is your princess castle tent. And you just saw, look at that, 
Uh, you just saw me very, very easily put that up. So, um, and the boys, you, you have got the rocket for the boys, the blue one, um, and that goes up exactly the same. So it's literally five minutes, bang, it's up, and it comes down just as quick, just as quick, uh, which what well, I'll, I'll kind of show you is that a little bit later on, how you can take that down. Uh, Lisa, can I have your sofa, please? No, oh, it's mine. It's mine. It's where I lie down and sit and watch me TV. So, the Pink Princess pop-up tech, can you believe, is £12.95, right? I'll stand here for a second. £12.95 for your Pink uh, Princess pop-up tent. But remember, up until 11.59 tonight, there's 20% off everything, including this. So, guys, you're going to pay for just over a tenner for this. Oh, come on. I mean, seriously, it was originally off for £26.95. Grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it. Uh, can you buy it in a store? I would, you, no, I don't know about this particular one, but I think you can probably, you know, I, in fact, no, I tell a lie. Tesco's have got this one in, and I think Tesco, I'm sure Tesco's is 26 95 Hang on, we'll have a look. Uh, I'll have a look on here, there is a second. Hang on, Tesco, I'm sure I saw it on Tesco. Uh, Tesco Direct Pink uh, Castle Pop-Up Tent. Let's just see. Just to give you a... I'm sure they had this, this same one. This one's an outdoor one as well, by the way. Uh, just to kind of let you know that. Um, very similar... I'm sure they had one which was very similar. Right, they've got they've got theirs on sale, which is very similar, uh, for $21.95. So that'll give you an idea. $21.95, they've Tesco Direct have got something on very, very similar. It's not as good as mine, actually. Um, then they've got they've got another one on which is very similar, which is $29.20. Uh, the boys one. Uh, oh, they've got right. They've got the boys one, which is exactly the same look. Hopefully you can see that. Which is exactly the same as the boys one. There. Theirs is 29.20. So, hello. Grab yourself a bargain. That's what this channel is all about. Let's get these back on Facebook now. There you go. So, uh, yeah, so grab yourself it now. Remember, you know where to go, guys. www.shopwithlisab.com uh, Edward Byron said, Lisa, it's on about your couch when you buy it. Lisa, it's on about your couch when you buy it. I'm confused that. Kirstie said, buy, buy, buy. Yes, if you've got little girls to buy for, buy. If you've got a little boy to buy for, uh, then get the boys' pop-up tent. Absolutely brilliant. And it's well, well worth it. It comes down really, really easy as well. Uh, where not when? Hang on, hang on. Where not when? Hang on. Lisa, it's he's on about your couch where you buy. All oh, right, he's on about where I bought me couch. <laughs> I see. I thought he wanted to buy me couch off me. <laughs> um, I bought the couch off the internet. Michael bought it actually. Bless him. Uh, off the internet. I picked it. He didn't like it. Um, but. And obviously I've added all the cushions to it. Obviously the big big black ones at the back, they come with it, but then I've added all the dressy cushions to it. Um, Lisa, can we see your sofa? I can't really move the camera. But hang on, I'll move that. I'm not selling me bloody sofa, I'm selling the bloody... <laughs> the castle. But there you go, there's my sofa. I'll let you have a look at my sofa. It is quite comfortable as well. So... That is your princess pop-up tent. Remember, you have got the rocket one for the boys as well. It works out at just over a tenner. Uh, Joanne Taylor is watching. Hi, Joanne. You probably think I'm a bit mad um, because I, I, but I've just put this tent up. I've literally just put the tent up. Um, so it's, it's, and, it, and it just showed you how easy it was. Now what I'm going to do, went round family to see who wants them to score. www.shopwithlisab.com Hope your sniffles clear up soon. Thank you, Mark Red Coxon. Thank you. So do I, because it really annoys us. Uh, especially, I've just had some lem sip. And then this, you're not supposed to do, I don't think, with lem sip, but never mind. But hey-ho. 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 Silver lining. Right, so now what I'm going to do is, 
which could go terribly wrong again, is I'm going to show you how quick it is to put it. So, you're going to see the backside again. I do apologise. It's like it's like a, an eclipse, isn't it? <laughs> it's like an eclipse, my backside. So, we're literally in the go. I'm going in, people. I'm going in. So, we'll unclip one. Take that one out. And what I love is that these just go down dead easy. So there's one. Obviously you've got your little bag for them as well. One. Uh, uh, uh. I should have this. Two. So you, you know, if you've got a, a, a tent that isn't a pop-up one like this, and if you haven't got a lot of room and you've got to think you've got to take it up and down constantly, it's got loads of bits and it's a nightmare, that would just be hell. Uh, this, no, this is just so easy. Oh, hang on, I've got to unclip it, it helps. Go, Put this one out. Boom, boom, boom. And then your next one, the last one. And there's like a little clip in that you just unclip it like so. Take that out. And then them, obviously, they've got a little bag. Where have I put the little bag for them? There it is there. So you pop them in that little bag. Come on. Hey, come on. There you go. Tie them up in a little bow. Tie it up in a bow. Like so. <laughs> uh, then this is the case of all you're doing with this is you literally you literally fold it and then it should all just fold into itself like so and then you put the bag to the pot up like that. Fold them down literally over. Oh no. Over that we are, it, it falls into itself and it falls into your circle and then into the bag it goes. So it's, I should say, hang on, hang on. Hey, I used to have this trouble when I worked with the bloody. Hang on, so it's fold in, and that's it. And then that falls down, squishes down, and it goes, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> there is a knack to this, I promise you. Hang on. Is it that way? Wait a minute. Oh, hang on. That way. Fold in half. I'm trying to think of when I used to do it with the with the tan and tens. Fold in half. And then that's it, that's it, that's it. There you go. That's it. And then you squeeze it all into the bag and voila, you're done. So it does, it just literally folds. You can see the little half there. Fold it over. And the good thing is, you can't, if you do it wrong, it's fine. Because you just do it again. But then you fold that into it. That into it. And that's it there. And then it goes into its bag. Like so. You know what? I've got the heating on. Because it was being poorly. And now I'm having a hot flush. So I do apologise. So that's it. In it goes. You can't go wrong with them, and you can't break it, do you know what I mean? Uh, so that's the good thing. Uh, pop that in there. Pop them in there. You're done. That, in the cupboard, in the toy cupboard. You would never have guessed that two minutes ago, I had a tent that big sitting here. Thank you very much, and good night. <laughs> uh, so there you go. That's your tent live. Uh, Kessie said, don't do yourself damage, Lisa. Leo said, my niece Olivia got, oh, thrush in her mouth, but getting better now, good. Uh, Kessie said, come on. Uh, Mark said, you've been working on Big TV too long. Uh, Lisa, just promote selling your couch. <laughs> Great entertainment, said Edward. Thanks. So, uh, I'm sweating now, though. I've actually got little sprinkles of sweat. Uh, right, so I'm going to turn this camera around. Uh, Mark said, great register, great demonstration, I thought you said registration there. So if I just, hi, if I just flip camera back, sorry if you feel a bit sick there when I do that, and then we'll flip the light back, 
And there you go. Done. So that tent there, my friends. Ta da! I know how amazing. Uh, it's working out with. So don't forget to go to www.shopwithlisab.com. Get yourself on there and um, put in when when you go to your checkout. Put in your code. If you are paying by PayPal, um, you you carry on all the way until you get to PayPal for checkout, and then it'll say, "Please apply your code." Put the code in B L K for black, F for Friday, twenty for your twenty percent off. But make sure you push the apply button. Christine didn't do that today. I didn't get off, Christine. Uh, so yeah, so you've got to press the apply button, and then it, your cart will add up to twenty percent off. So, um, and that's it. That's all you need to do. So, guys, um, that is your princess, pink princess pop of tent. But like I said, we'll we have got the blue rocket tent on there as well, the same price. Well, well worth it. Well worth it. We can't go wrong with them. Ta -da! Lisa, watching you now is, is better now than when you was on Bid TV. You were very funny. Oh, thanks, Mark. It's because nobody's here to tell us off. Jenny used to tell us off all the time. Uh, and, and nobody has to tell. Yeah, there's Christine going, ha, 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 ha. <laughs> Don't you worry, we'll sort it by you, Christine. So who else have we got in? Uh, we've got, oh, who else have we got? I'm just looking at the messages there. Right, you're probably sitting thinking, what the hell, Lisa? It is, there is a reason, if you haven't seen me play this game. Uh, this is a tosser's game. Oh, yes, there's plenty of people who can play this. Uh, this is for five years and above what i love about this is just knowing how many of you are going to be playing this and do you know what all the people who get games and stuff uh from me i want little videos and little pictures on christmas day if you're all playing it um and and i want and i want to be able to put them on my page i've already, I've already had a picture uh come in of uh, a lovely gorgeous little girl who got the perfume set of, i must be for her birthday i think and she loved it, she absolutely loved it. So I want to get loads of pictures of you putting them on there. But what's this all about? This is a bit of fun. You can play this at the kitchen table. I got a bit competitive with the girls last week with this, I have to say. Uh, night, night, Lisa, it's been entertaining. Keep up the good work. Night, Mark, my darling. Uh, do you know Claire? She used to be Adam's boyfriend from Bid TV. Adam. Adam as in Adam presenter. It's getting close now, Lisa, to start work and feeling this. Oh, yes, you start on Friday, don't you, Leo? Um, <laughs> Everyone just wants me couch. Uh, Joanne Pittendry is watching. Hi, Joanne. Uh, our Susan's watching as well. Hi, Susan, darling. Susan's bought this. Susan got this for our grandkids on Christmas Day. Because it's literally, there's a couple of ways you can play this. You can either keep it very still and you're chucking the rings. That, that really soft and fair, but if they do hit you in the face, they're not going to kill you, so don't worry. Um, oh, Joanne's in. Jo See, Joanne's coming because she's seen me playing this. This is what me and Joanne and Vicky and Harrison were playing last week. Um, oh, oh, Harrison, I hope you had a lovely birthday as well. Adam the Magician. No, Martin. Adam uh, married Leanne. That's who Adam's with. Uh, Adam married Leanne, one of the producers. Yes. And she's a midwife now, I think. Um, <laughs> Lisa, has Michael not put a ring on your finger yet? But I've got one, I just don't wear it. <laughs> There's a reason. Oh, did you find out how much paid, paid iron was? So did now. Edward, I sent them a message and they're going to get back to me. So I should know by tomorrow. So can you email uh, me your email address and then I can, I can email you and let you know. Um, what do you do now after price drop? Uh, I went into sales out of business development manager, which I loved. But I missed you guys too much. Um, so, yeah. Uh, so this, you literally... You can, you can kind of set, I'm, I'm kind of doing this back to front, but you like toss the rings because it's a tosser's game. Uh, you've got red and green so you can go in a team. You could even have like the top ones is one point, the second one is two and the, thir and the third one is three. Or the person who's wearing it has to try and catch them. So you can do it two ways, the person who's tossing the rings or the person who's trying to catch them and runs around. But I think at the at, at Christmas table dinner, yeah, literally it's just like a little extra game to play. Oh, I forgot to put this on. So bear in mind, right, that the price of this at the moment is very low anyway, but 20% off, 
off everything, off everything across the board uh, until tonight at 11.59. Oh, I'll quickly show you. I'll quickly show you the boys one. There's the rocket. I don't know if you can see that. I don't know if you can see that properly. But that's the rocket there. You probably can't see that very well. Uh, but it's it's very similar, obviously, to the um the, the, the it's exactly the same the way to put it, but it's just for, meant for boys. Uh, and it's the same price, $12.95, but just over a tenner if you are putting your code in B L K F 20 on www.shopwithlisab.com. That's what this website is. So we're looking for this game, aren't we? Let's have a look. Oh, I'm having a right sweat on. Oh, not nice. My bum is sticking to the chair. So, oh, by the way, I've got very limited amounts on those gillies as well, or gillet, or whatever you want to call it. Gillet, which has been spelt wrong. Uh, where's where's my tosser game? There it is. So, it's down to £7.95, right? You get three red rings, three green rings with it. The inflatable reindeer ring toss, it's £7.95. Uh, but but if, when you've got 20% off that, let me work that out for you. Um, bear with us, bear with us, bear with us. So, you see, £7.95, take 20%, equals £6.36. That's what you paid for this, £6.36. You might as well get it just for an extra little game. But then the adults can play. You can, I mean, you could really go bad with it with the adults. You can have it like a shot game. If, if you get one, you get like a shot or whatever. But you can have a lot of fun with it. Uh, Jack, uh, Jacqueline Wollaston, hello, is watching. William, <laughs> William Fox, which is Joanne, said, I love this game. Uh, need to talk offline. My fault. When I order two facial oils and one snake mask card still shows a previous sales. Confused. Help, JJ. I'll give you a buzz soon, don't worry. <laughs> uh, what are the studios now then? Um, well, the studios are now um, the new shopping channel. Um, is it Shopping Nation? Which I quite like. With Debbie. Uh, Debbie Greenwood. Uh, that's the big TV studios now. So, yeah. Oh, Mama's watching. Uh, Frida Brash is watching. Hi, Mama. Yeah, your daughter looks a bit of a nugget, but why change the habit of a lifetime? <laughs> know what I mean? Ma'am, look, I've had, I've took some of your, um, I've took some of your tablets that you gave us and now I'm having a beer with it. I know it's not the best thing to do. But I'm trying everything. I've got my snot rag. What said what happened to the Bid TV studios? Yeah, it, uh, it's now Shopping Nation. Um, Adam Pearson. <laughs> Uh oh, excuse me. John Surrey's watching. Hi, John. Yeah, you've probably just tuned in and thought, what the hell? It's the tosser game. It's the tosser game, so it suits me to the ground. Suits you, sir. Uh remember www.shopwithlisab.com is the um is the website to go on. All the products are on there. Oh, snotty blotty. <laughs> I'm going to take this off now. Um, and this works. This is working out with your 20% off just over six quid. So it's a little bit of fun to be had. It's going to keep, you know, while you're making the dinner, mams, the kids are eating, I mean, I'm saying the kids are eating something to keep them entertained. <coughs> Excuse me. I haven't put my proper mic on for a reason because I knew I'd be coughing and spluttering. And uh, I didn't want to be coughing, spluttering into the mic because it sounds even worse. So, but yeah, they'll have loads of, they'll have loads and loads of like toys and stuff to play with. But you know what? And you'll always find, it's a little bit like when they open the crackers and they find the, the, the games out, the, the crackers and the daft things. That keeps me satisfied all day and yet you spent 300 quid on a PlayStation. Do you know what I mean? So it's them kind of games that keep them going. And this is just fun games. Um, so, uh, Mark Mark he says, do you miss the old days of bid and why? What was best? And what was best? Yes, I do miss the days of bid without a shadow of a doubt. Um, I loved bid TV. I loved the fun of it. That's why I started this, to be honest, because I miss doing it. I miss doing it. The only thing that I find that I miss when I'm doing this is, obviously, I've got, like, the camera guys, the producers, all the likes of that at bid TV. Um, and... I had, like, somebody to bounce off. Not literally. <laughs> I would be wrong. Um, but as in banter. But that's where you guys come into play. But I prefer doing this because I think this is a lot more interactive. Obviously, I would see names come up at the bottom of the screen who had bought. And 
I kind of started the trend of where you could tweet in. And uh, obviously, when we used to sell the mobile phones, I used to give the mobile phone number. And I started that trend up because I loved, I loved interacting with these all. But the producers would be like, get back to the product. Product is king. That was the same. Oh, tell you what do you know what I mean? No, I'm talking to the people. Uh, keep that in favour, radiator. <laughs> radiator? Reindeer on, so funny. John says, hi, Lisa, feel crap. Cheer me, up, cheer me up. My friend Sarah says, hi, too. Hi, Sarah. Hi, John. I feel crap as well. I've got the sniffles. I'll make you feel better. Surely, surely, when you came in and I'm sitting there with a pig and reindeer on my head, you must have thought that was funny. You must have definitely thought that was funny. Uh, Ellen Finn's in. Mary somebody's in. Hi, Mary, darling. Um... So yeah, so I do, I do miss, I do miss uh, big TV, but we're going to turn this into big TV. This is what this is. This is going to be bigger than uh, big TV. Did my night cream go through today? Yes, it did, Christine. It did. We've got it there. JJ's going to sort the yeah code out for you because you didn't put your twenty percent in. Um, but yes, you got it. You got it, darling. And you got your. You got your splatter face as well, didn't you? You got splatter face today. Uh, we all missed watching you. Uh, I missed you as well. No, glad you back. Me too. Like I say, those names weren't real. Weren't real. They were at the bottom of the screen on Bid TV. Oh, yes, they were. Oh, yes, the names. Oh, they were all real. They were people who I'd bought in. Yeah, they were. That's why you used to see if I used... And I used to, I used to prove it to you because if I bought anything... I would it would come up Lisa from South Shields. If your man bought anything, it would be it would be Frida from South Shields. Um, someone someone told me the name at the bottoms of the screen weren't real. Yeah, though the word definitely real. Uh, Lisa, which was best to be honest, bid TV or price drop? Oh, I started off at bid. Then I went to speed auction. Then I went back to bid. No, I went to, started off at bid for a year. Then I went over to speed auction. No, I was on bid for two years. I've got to get this right. Uh, I was on I was on bid TV for two years. Then I went over to speed auction TV for. Oh God, I was on speed auction T speed auction bid and price drop for six years. And then the last year I was on price drop. Um, my names came up every time I bought, said Karen Hughes. Yeah, it did. It, it, was, it was all real. And when we used to say, I've got so and so on the, so many on the phone lines, that was real. Uh, none of it was kind of a sales technique, I promise you. Um, but yeah, so my favourite was actually probably Speed Auction TV. That was my baby. That was my baby. I know that wasn't on Freeview. Well, it was for a while and then they took it off, didn't they? Um, but Speed Auction was my baby. I kind of me and Lynn Taylor kind of started that up. Uh, Lisa is brilliant family, yes, but I was divorced in 1977. Still love brashies, except my ex. <laughs> uh, I hear you, sister. I hear you. Uh, price drop uh, bid was rubbish. Um, I think, do you know what? I don't think it was the channel itself. I just think it was depending on what you got on, really, whether the presenter was your cup of tea or not. Do you know what I mean? Um, because as much as, like, you guys loved us on there, which was amazing and I loved it, for every for every ten people that loved us, there was two people that couldn't stand us. <laughs> um, what happened? Uh, the Bid TV was bought by Grant Miller, wasn't it? Apparently it was bought... Is that Grant Miller who owns... He used to own the Sunday Sport or something. I heard he had bought it. Um, oh, you're talking about... Um, no, you're not. No, hang on. Are you talking about the one that's on now, Shopping Nation? Are they talking about the one that's on Shopping Nation? Um, and the one that Debbie Greenwood is... Because I contacted Debbie Blesser. And I was like, oh, look, I'd love to come back. Um, you know, I'd, I'll come and I'll do a few shows for you. And bless her, she was very diplomatic. <laughs> and she went... Um, Shred, your energy might just be a little bit too much for what we're looking for on the channel. <laughs> okay. <laughs> totally understand. I think I scared Debbie when she first came to bed. Lovely lady, proper lady. Do you know what I mean? Proper lady. And then there comes in this kind of beer swigging kebab eating bird in the dressing room with a big dirty kebab. Um, loved all shopping channels, but only when Lisa was on. Oh, thanks so. Do you know, it's people... 
like I say, people either loved or loved us. It depended. Do you know what I mean? Uh, which I understand. I get on my own nerves at times. Hi, Lucy Walker. Hope you're well, darling. Uh, well, you've missed out on the tent. You've missed out on the Christmas Jingle Inflatable Reindeer Games. But don't worry, I've got some more stuff coming for you. Uh, we'll see you night, sweet dreams. Thank you for today. Thank JJ for me. See you tomorrow. I will do, Christy. I'll get it sorted out for you, babe. Don't you worry. Um, we'll get you sorted. Uh, no, apparently last year it was coming back. The website was up again and then it went sunny. Yes, um, it was apparently the guy who owned the Sunday's, the Sunday's Sport bought it and they were going to bring it back and they just never did. Um... So funny when Robbie Williams' story broke, laugh out loud. Oh, story of my life, that. Um, do you remember a shopping channel called Shop back in the late 90s? No, I don't, because I only ever really watched Big TV uh, and Price Drop TV before I worked on them. And I got quite starstruck when I went in. I remember when I first started, I was really like, oh my God, I watch these every night. Like, I used to love watching Mike Mason, um, which I ended up dating for three years, um, which was ironic, really, because I was a big fan of his. Uh, loved Peter Simon, which became one of my best friends. Um, I loved watching Adele Seeker, which she became one of my best friends. Uh, who else did I love watching? Um, who was my favourite to watch? trying to think who my favourite was to watch. Probably Peter Simon, Mike Mason, the funny ones. I like the funny ones. A lot of people just like people who just sell and that they don't want any jokes, they don't want any fun with it, they just want to sell products, which is fine. But I like the funny side of things. Adele off bit always liked her boobs hanging out. <laughs> She's actually, actually, she mentioned this last night on, uh, she, she does the uh, Jackpot 24-7 now. And I, I was watching her last night at about two o'clock in the morning. I finished clearing up here and I emailed her and I was like, hi, babe, you look fab. I've missed you. And the next thing she's like, Lisa B's watching. I was like, hey, you down. Uh, so, yeah, yeah, very, very crazy, very wild. So, guys, I know a lot of you have been so, so interested in um, the beauty products that I've been bringing to you. Now, I'm not bringing this one just yet. But I'm going to quickly explain it to you. The reason I'm not bringing it is because I've started using it. I want to make sure, I want to see if I can see anything with it for, uh, first. Do you ever watch any of your clips on YouTube? I don't. I don't. I'm not really. I mean, I know there's hundreds. Of, I've seen a few of them. Um, but I, I don't. I'm, I'm kind of, I'm sick of my own garb. I don't want to hear it in kind of, you know, in, in stereo. <laughs> um, so this is the Tummy Perfect Lifting and Toning. Now, um, I don't know, I've never, I've, I'll be honest with you, I've never needed to use products like this up until about the last year and a half. And I've always wondered if these products work, right? Um, so I have, I've managed to get some of these in. It is from the Cougar brand and it is a, it is a, um, it's a, 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 a product that you just literally rub on the tummy. And apparently, if you're doing kind of any exercising, like yoga or exercising on the tummy, putting this on as well is supposed to help to tone it. So um, I'm giving it a go. I'm going to let you know if it's any good or not. If it is, brilliant. If it's not, then we won't bring it. But I'm going to try. Uh, aftershave, Lisa, for men. Yes, I have some. Uh, Andy Oliver was nice on shopping channels. Yeah, Andy's lovely. He's lovely, Andy. I love Andy. Um, Eva's got... Do you know what? Paul Evers was one of the funniest men I'd ever... Honestly, he was so funny, Paul. I mean, I'm talking like he's dead. He's not, obviously. He still is very funny, I'm sure. Um, but honest, I mean, when he first started... And ...to the presenters when I worked there, obviously, because that was my job and I didn't bother. And then the times that he started to be on, I used to take over from him. So I would be in the studios about 15 minutes before he would come off and I'd start listening to his kind of banter. Very, very cleverly funny him. Very funny. Very, very good one-liners. <laughs> Love the fact you use Lou, Lou Rose's hanky. I do too. Oh, there's now posh about me. Kind of be, these are me, this is my little one as well. But I will admit this is the padded little one. This is the expensive little one. <laughs> Can't be bothered with hankies. So, uh, so that's going to be coming soon. It's the Tummy Perfect Lifting and Toning. So you're literally just putting it into the tummy. If you are kind of doing a few little exercises on the tummy, um, give it a go with it. This I will put on the, I'll put on the site tomorrow, um, but I'm going to use it for the next couple of weeks and let you know. No, never use a uh, literal wipe your nose, makes it worse, use tissues. I know somebody has taught us that because it's a little bit too rough, isn't it? But hey-ho. Now... These are, these are the only two 
I've got two left of the Snake Venom Purifying Face Mask. I've got no moisturizers left. They are coming back. I am, uh, am reordering some more in. Um, but these are the Snake Venom. I used mine again today. Uh, I love it. I love the feel of how my skin is when I've put that on. I then put three drops of that on and I then put my moisturizer on. Unbelievable, guys. Unbelievable. Uh, Lisa, let's hear your melody. Right, you want to go to the website? www.shopwithlisab.com and dab. Uh, get yourself on the website. That's where everything is. There's 20% off everything uh, up until 11.59 tonight. Reminds me of comedian that sweats. I've got little bits of sweat above my lips, actually. <laughs> I know, it's not a sexy look, is it? So, um, obviously, you guys know I loved, I loved, I loved, I loved my snake serum. In fact, I watched a, um, just, just today, I watched a, a lady on YouTube. Because what I do is I upload now or this video, so I'm doing this live to you and then I upload it to my YouTube channel for, for the YouTubers to watch it. And um, I was watching today a, a, a lady doing the review on the snake serum that I used to sell. And uh, she was going through it and she was saying it was fantastic and, and she thought it was amazing. Um, she said her only downfall of it was, was that obviously you have to continue to use it, which obviously you do. I mean, that makes sense. Um, but she said she really liked the results, but then she went onto their website, which was Skin Pharmacy or Skin Chemist. And uh, she couldn't believe the price because there were £120 on there. But she loved the idea of snake venom. Me too, me too. Um, so if I'm short of blue, I use tissues with white with balm on. Nice soft booty, nice. Oh, nice. Uh, oh God, yeah. Me, 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 San Miguel. You can see I'm not well. You can see I'm not well. I forgot me San Miguel song. Oh man, can't believe I did that. Um. Oh, hang on. Nobody reminded us about the telly. So we'll go to products. Okay. Now I've only got two of these left as well now. So this is, I would definitely advise, now, oh no, oh, oh, hello, I didn't do any of that. What's happened there? Hang on, we'll go back. There you go. Um, even if you haven't got the moisturisers, right? it is better with the moisturisers because you're using the same brand and all the ingredients kind of work together. But even if you haven't got the moisturiser yet, this is a fantastic, this and this you can still use with your existing moisturiser, which is brilliant. Um, so the, the, the face mask, I would advise you to use that twice a week as a, a, as a really intense treatment to the face. There is it. You get loads in as well. You literally put just a thin layer on the face. I let it says to leave on for two to three minutes. I'll be honest with you. I left mine on for about ten minutes today. Um, so I had loads to do. Um, Tracy Brain's watching. Hi, Tracy. Uh, John said my mate Sarah is logging on now. Watch out for her. Okay, I will. Um, so yeah. So with this, I literally put like a thin layer on. I left on for about fifteen minutes. Then I went and I just washed it off with warm water. I then patted my face dry. I didn't rub it. I patted it dry. Got that dried off. Then I put three drops of that on. And then I put my moisturiser on. OMG. Please try these. Please, 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 please try these. You will feel a difference instantly. Instantly. Now at least I have to go, I have to go back to hospital tomorrow. <gasps> Karen, text me, let me know how it went today. And good luck for tomorrow, darling. Oh, you poor thing. Um, so yes, so, um, that's what, that's what I need you to do. I need you, I need you to try this. And obviously I used to say that to you about the, the, the snake serum that I used to have at Bid TV. But the problem was you were paying like, originally like a hundred quid for it. Then it went down to about 70. Then I used to sell it for 60. Then it went down to like 50. And then I think the lowest that I sold was like 40 pound or something. Um, but, oh, this sneeze. Look at the light, look at the light. Does that isn't it? Oh, it stopped now. I hate that. You know, when you just get it going, it was sneezing and then it stops. I hate it. How long can you record live for? Um, I can record live for as long as I want. On this, darling. Terry Tibbs was quite funny. Oh, do you know, there's a story about that. That was obviously the, the, um, the phone jacker, wasn't it? I was actually supposed to be on that shift. 
and they put uh, Maria on. I was supposed to be doing that shift on Price Drop, but they said we cannot put Lisa B on there with Terry Tibbs because she will A, suss it out straight away, but B, she'll like proper go along with it. You needed that kind of like shock factor and you needed that like, or, you know, that nervousness. I would have been, I would have, I would have loved it. I would have gone with the flow. Do you know what I mean? So that they wouldn't let me go on with it. That's that's why they took me off shift. Nobody knew it was happening because I was quite surprised. Like, why take me off shift? Like, oh, we need you on. I can't remember. Oh, no, we need you to do voiceovers instead. I was like, all right, okay, then. Because nobody knew. Hi, Lisa, it's Sarah. John Surrey's mate. Hi, Sarah Horn. I promised I'd give you a shout out. Uh, Deborah Roberts is there as well. Uh, keep my face mask on and two oils. Don't know what is going on. All products I've bought are on cart. What want new buys? Face mask and two oils. I'll sort you out, babes. Don't worry. Don't worry. Even if uh, even if they want to go on, I'll get you sorted out because I've got to order some more. <laughs> Um, but they are amazing, they are amazing. Um, so yeah, so if you literally leave, if you literally leave the mask on uh, for, it says two to three minutes, I'll let it on a little bit longer, put, just take it off with warm water, three drops of that on, and then the moisturiser, brilliant. If you still want to continue to use your own, fine, do that. If you're thinking, oh, I'm not, I've just bought some L'Oreal, or I've just bought some Lancome, or whatever it is that you use, Estee Lauder, you know, to name but a few, um, if that's fine, that's fine, you can still use these with that, but then when your other moisturiser runs out, then let me know, and I'll get my hands on some of the Snake Venom Day and Night Moisturiser, and it's so, so cheap. This is, I hate the word, use the word cheap, because I think it cheapens the brand, but it is just so low priced. Um, so there you can see, 13 50 and it really does go a long way. I only put a little layer on. It kind of dries and then you just wipe it off. Please, please try it. This is a very luxurious, intense treatment. Um, like I say, I would use this for about twice a week for the first three weeks and then just move it on to once a week. But you will feel a difference immediately. You'll feel your skin immediately. And especially adding three drops of that after it, which I'll talk about in a second. So that there is your £3.50. Obviously, up until midnight, you've got your 20% off. Don't worry, Sue, I'll get you sorted out, babes. Um, so you can see there, 13 50 If you work it out, 20% off, you get 2 70 off. So you're going to literally be paying what? 2 70 off that. You're literally going to be paying... <laughs> just over a tenner just over a tenner for it bye 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 that's my advice to you bye 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 uh so that is and it's 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 a it's a it's a large bottle as well it's just it's kind of i'm not going to open that because that's obviously one of the products that uh, i'm going to send out because they're the only two i've got left so that's them there that obviously is the tubby perfect one which i've just started to try now so that's your um that's your snake venom purifying face mask please get it please give it a go you will see what i'm talking about you'll see why i'm begging you to get it because it is amazing and i'm only bringing something to the channel that i've used and that i love and that i think you guys will love you will love that i am literally telling you right now you will love it there you go that's how confident i am that's how confident i am um oh was that a message i got no don't think it was uh right hang on so this is your acai and your goji berry now i went into it in really great depth last night so i'm not going to do it uh tonight don't worry i'm not going to bore you again as i know a lot of you's got bored uh but that again is just an absolute must right that one's an absolute must before you moisturize uh, uh, before you moisturize morning and night literally just put three one two three that's all you need put three of those on massage it into the skin up over like so and to the neck it smells lovely and to the neck um it'll go on a bit tacky let it dry just let it dry in the skin and then put your moisturizer on you will be like wow you'll be able to feel it working pa the most powerful the most powerful antioxidant in the world that the acai berry that's what they're claiming now that's what they're claiming and the goji berry is called in asia it's called the fountain of youth beautiful absolutely beautiful uh that is um uh, night lisa it's been fun watching you oh night night my darling mark warby warburton hi julie hope you're well gorgeous uh give my love to everybody there as well uh so so yeah so uh you can see you've got your your uh there your beauty treatments there 
Uh, absolutely brilliant. I'll tell you what, Julie, I'm quite surprised that you didn't get um, you didn't get Steph one of the makeup things because I think Steph would have loved that because the makeup and it's fab. Uh, I remember you stripped on Bid TV. It was funny. And Marina Berry was good too. Yeah, Marina Berry. She was a great assistant. Well, she was actually, she, she was a great presenter. I used to hate calling me assistants because they were just as good as us. Uh, Jane Foley's in. Hi, Jane, darling. So that's your cleansing regime sorted. Remember everything. Oh, I haven't got long for you. 20% either. No, you haven't. It, it finishes in exactly 50 minutes. It will go off at 23.59. So your BLK, BLK, uh, F for Black Friday, 20. 20% 20 of everything, even the really, really stupidly low price uh, toys and games. Uh, I do have uh, some new aftershaves and perfumes coming on tomorrow. Oh, God. When I add two on a face mask, it says cart 178.60. Uh, love you, but not that much. <laughs> Can you, Susan, can you just go in and clear your card? Hang on. Let, actually, I think I've got a card on here. Let's see. If you go in, hang on, if I go into, right, see, right, I've got a card on here. So this is obviously the website, www.shopwithlisabee.com. If you go into there, hang on. Oh, come on, come on, come on. So that's me card. Now, if I go into my cart, what I would do, what I would do, Horn, is I would literally, you can see there that if you go to remove, so so go into remove and remove everything. Remove it, so remove the blue rubber pop-up tent, the Beaumondi woman's gift set, remove that, and then I'll remove that. Oops, something went wrong. What have I kind of, oh, cut, right. So it said card update and empty card. That's fine because we don't want to update it. So return to the previous page. So if I go to the previous page, if I click on that, and then it should take us back. There you go. And my cart is currently empty. So then you can carry on shopping. Try that. Try that, Sue. See what happens there. I won't let you. Hang on. JJ! So it wouldn't let you remove that, right? Hang on. I'm gonna sneeze. <coughs> oh, sorry, excuse me. Hang on, hang on, hang on. <laughs> Get the man to it. Let's see what happens. He's been the gun club tonight. Probably not pick up. Hang on. He tries with a phone. Oh, his blubbing nose is driving me insane. He tries with a phone. You need to go to bed and rest. I will. I'm going I'm, to... I'm, I'm trying to have a hot bath to sweat it out today. Um... I'll get you sorted soon. Don't we? I'll, you'll get your 20% as well still. I'll make sure of it. If you can't, I'm surprised it won't let you empty your card. Did you do exactly what I did there? That's, that's, I'll, I'll, but I'll get it sorted for you, babes. I'll get it sorted for you. Uh, so, I will run through. We'll run through some bits and bobs. Oh, this nose is driving me insane. Uh, it's more tissue. Trying that now. Ca can't clear card. Oh, that's really bizarre. Is it got like, is it giving you the option? Night, Brenda, darling. Oh. <coughs> um, is it giving you the option? Is it giving you that option which you did there for me? So let's see, I'll just go to products. Let's have a look. So if I go to products. Right, I'm just going to click the first one. Uh, right, so we'll go to the Bullmudgy Woman set, which I'll, uh, in fact, no, I'll go to this one, this is my favourite product. So we'll go get that. So I'll add it to my cart. So that's fine. 
So then I'm going to go over the little handbag here, which is my cart. Oh, I know it's coming up there. So is it not giving me the option to remove that? See how I've got remove on there. Hang on, you might be able to see that actually. To the fix it up. But that there says remove underneath the product. Does that not give you the option to do that? Oh, that's bizarre. I'll get Gigi on the case. We'll get him on the case. Uh, so, uh, quickly I'll run through um, the... <laughs> Love that. Shove tissues on both sides of your nose. I know, it's just drowned at sea. It really is. Uh, by the way, if you've got any really little ones to buy for uh, this Christmas, uh, this is ideal. This is your giant floor size uh, alphabet floor puzzle. This is three plus. Each piece is that big, so times that by 45, so you're going to get you know a good size. The kids are going to really take something away from this as well. Um, I always used to buy Harley the likes of things like this when she was little because Harley was born deaf, bless her. And then she had the operation to put her hearing right. Um, and then about three months after she had the hearing put right, she had a freak accident where she fell off the sofa and bit her tongue off. I know. And she had to have like surgery to build it all back up. It was horrific. And um, so I was convinced that she was going to be kind of held back because of these, these bits and bobs. Um, and it was things like this, I swear, that helped her. Um, Graham said, would it not be easier to connect your laptop to your TV and show it that way? It probably would, but I haven't got a clue how to do that. <laughs> uh, Graham said, uh, even if he said, get well soon. Oh, I know it's driving us insane. It's blooming cold. Uh, so yes, yeah, alphabet floor puzzle. Absolutely brilliant. It's problem solving. It's hand and eye coordination as well. It's imaginative play. But in the kids' eyes, they're just going to be having a bit of fun. They're not realising that they're actually learning as they go. So this works out, it's 63 centimetres by 43 centimetres. So it's a big one. It's a big one on the floor. You can sit there with the bands. You can sit there and you can be like, A is for apple and, you know, and sit and play with them. And it's so imagine, you know, it, it, it captures their imagination that as they get a little bit older and they start doing it themselves, they'll love it. Uh, thank you. TV behind you, honey. Thank you. Uh, David Parkman's in. Hi, hon. Hope you're well, my darling. So... Uh, I'm going to bring you to, now I'm going to bring you to the shoes, I loved these, uh, I loved these and I got them on, uh, we have got them in the red and we have got them in the black as well, love them, um, I'm going to change the telly a second, I'm just going to whisk these, oh my god, I'm not, no I'm not, no I'm not, so they're on the way. Like quickly showing them in all different sizes. We've got them in the red, got them in the black. I'm just whizzing through stuff now because I'm, I'm going to get myself away in a second. Um, you've got your perfume set. I haven't got very many of these left, by the way. Uh, I do have some new perfumes coming tomorrow. I've got uh, just single perfumes on their own um, and uh, aftershaves. Uh, we bought that for Aiden when he was three and he loved it and mastered it. Yeah, the big floor puzzles, they're brilliant. <laughs> They don't realise that it's, it's actually helping the kids. It's helping them along uh, with, with loads of different things. Like I say, like the, the hand and eye coordination, obviously the, the mental attitude. Uh, will you be getting in stuff for animals, except a bed's toys? Do you know what? I was looking at things like that. I was actually looking at stuff that must have read my mind. I'm having, I'm having a little bit of a think about that for all you animal lovers. That's really weird because it was just the other day I said I need to to look into stuff like that. I was actually trying to look into Christmas hampers for the animals. Um, so watch this space, I am trying, I am trying. I was trying to see what I can get. Oh, my nose is so sore to touch. Uh, right. So you've got your um, Beaumondi set here. You've got your 100 mils. When will these side capsules uh, be on this up? Next week, John. I'm getting them in next week. Uh, I can't wait for them. I've got I've got loads of other different stuff coming as well, but I'm not going to be bringing all the others till January because uh, obviously they're all health stuff and I've got um, I've got all the 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 kind of uh, meal supplement stuff coming and all that except but I'm not going to do that till January. But I am going to do the Asai um, supplements next week because obviously they work really well with the the skin. So I am doing that. Um, the alphabet is brilliant, well worth buying. Thank you, Graham. I totally agree. If you've got little ones, it is just a little hand. 
definitely, definitely a little bit of a helping hand. So you've got your 100 mils of your Beaumondi perfume. You've got your uh, 50 mils of your hand and body lotion, 50 mils of your shower gel. And then you've also got uh, your 15 mils there, 10 mils, sorry, of your roll on. Now it's all on up of ham. Running through it with you, car chose everything I've bought. Probably my fault, did follow through with you. And it won't let you delete. Hmm, that's strange. That's really strange. I'll get you sorted out. I'll get JJ to give you a ring or something. Uh, oh, I'll go through with you. I, I, I wonder what I can do if I can... I wonder if I can get onto it and if I can delete the cart. I'll try that. I'll try that. And then I'll still give you the 20% off. Don't worry. I'll get you sorted, babes. Um, Tima writes in as well. Hi, Tima. So, uh, that there, and again, it's a gift for somebody who you just don't know what to buy for, and you're a bit like, oh, if I get them a present, they're really difficult to buy for, they're a bit of a nightmare, um, then don't worry, don't worry. You can't go wrong with perfume. doesn't matter if you've got one bottle of favourite perfume or 20 bottles of perfume. We'll never, ever, ever have enough because there's, there's always going to be something. Do you know what? This could be just for the daytime and then they might have something for the night or this might be the night time and they prefer something through the day. Perfumes, you just don't go wrong. You don't go wrong with perfume. And especially not when they're 100 mils and especially in, I love the bottle as well, the glass bottle. That's glass there, the pink glass bottle. An odd up because our toilet doesn't last as long as our upper fan. Um, then you've got your brilliant for taking out the about. So, ladies, you've got a little handbag this Christmas. Maybe it's a little, and I am trying to get handbags as well. Uh, John's got to go now. See you tomorrow night. Nana, it's sleep tight. Don't let the Betty Bugs bite. Mwah. Love you, John, my darling. See you tomorrow. Uh, so, yeah, you've got this, this, you've got your shower gel, and you've got your hand and body cream there as well. So that's just some of the stuff. Hope I will have some new bits uh, coming tomorrow. So I'm going to go and try now and have a look and see if I can get you sorted out, Chuck. Uh, remember, everything 15% off. You've literally only got... Oh, you've literally only got, what, half an hour left? That's it for your 20% off. So grab, grab, grab as quick as you can. That, that is, not me. And I will be back tomorrow uh, at quarter past ten. I will have a couple of new products for you tomorrow as well. Um, so make sure you are with me. And I'm going to sign out like I always do, my gorgeous. Uh, night, night. Sleep tight. Don't you dare let those bloody bed bugs bite. Mwah. Love yous all. Night, night. Oh, Edward said he loves Christmas, but shopping's hard. Edward, come back tomorrow. We'll get you sorted. See you tomorrow. Love yous. Bye. Ugh. <sighs>